Hey there, YouTube. Hey, I thought I'd document this because it's different. Uh, we're big fans of the Land Lakes Extra Melt product and also of a product called Selecto, which is a white American cheese. This is yellow cheese and it's by Mid America Farms. It's called Jiffy Melt. We bought this at Sam's Club. Fast, fast melting, smooth and creamy, pasteurized processed American cheese. Five pounds. It was about $11.50 or something like that. And I know some people would say, why would you buy this when you could just buy Velveeta? Well, those of you all who are familiar with Land Lakes Extra Melt know that Extra Melt melts completely different and also has a richer taste than regular um, processed cheeses like Velveeta. This is distributed by Dairy Farmers of America Incorporated, Kansas City, Missouri. Ingredients are cultured milk and skim milk, water, cream, sodium phosphate, salt, lactic acid, artificial color, and enzymes. And as far as the nutrition facts go, it says one ounce is 110 calories, total fat 9 grams, saturated fat 6 grams, cholesterol 25 milligrams, sodium 360 milligrams, total carbs 1, protein 5. Vitamin A, 6%, calcium, 15%, vitamin C, 0%, iron, 0%. Sorry for the dark lighting here in the kitchen, but we're going to um, cut this into some blocks and put it in a dish and nuke it, microwave it real quick, and just kind of see what the texture and consistency is. And if this is anything like Land Lakes Extra Melt, then we've got ourselves a winner here. All right, hold on. So I just opened this box, and this is what it looked like inside. Just show you, showing you this. Point it out. This is what it looked like inside, in the wrap. Great for sandwiches, pasteurized, processed American cheese. I checked. It does have the same um, UPC number that's on the box. What I do find of note is that the expiration date is printed on here. It says sell by April 25th of 19. So it's not marked anywhere on the box, the expiration, but on the packaging it is. So I'm making this video here in May. It's actually June the 3rd of 2018, but we purchased it like May the 25th of 2018. So. It's almost an 11 month uh, out shelf life on this. I'm gonna cut some of it off and put it in the microwave real quick and we'll see how it turns out. All right, so just cut off a little slug of it, about an inch and a half thick. Some cubes, I'm gonna throw these in this microwave over here that we bought at Target for $40. It had terrible reviews and now two and a half years later, it still works perfectly. So just to show that you can't trust the bad reviews on Target's website. All right, this is after nuking it for 30 seconds. Or rather, two, two sections of 30 seconds each. It didn't foam up, didn't brown on the edge. It's nice and smooth and creamy and what I would certainly call jiffy melt. We're gonna throw some jalapenos in here and see what it tastes like. But tentatively, it seems like it's a winner. We've done some experimenting with the Jiffy Melt and we have found a little concoction that's fantastic. It's the Jiffy Melt, some chopped up uh, Costeño jalapeno peppers like so many of the Mexican restaurants use. And we're using 1% milk because that's what we had, but I'm sure if we had whole milk it would per turn out even better, but this way it's pretty fantastic. Let's nuke it for about one minute. All right, this is now after 40 seconds of microwaving, and I pulled it out every 20 seconds to stir it up a little bit. But it's that great kind of runny, cheesy consistency you find in all the Mexican restaurants. We do it another 20 seconds, and it should be good to go. So this is after three 20 second intervals of nuking this on the microwave. And um, all it is is Jiffy Melt. Milk, 1% milk, jalapenos from La Costeña. And that's it. And stirred quite a bit. Mmm, muy bien. Fantastico. I know, it's corny.